Hey guys, this is Ron Moore, and this is just a little update I want to been up to lately. Um, so as some of you know, I moved again. I've been doing a lot of moving in the past three years, um, but the good thing about moving this time is I'm back to my old apartment complex, which is very, very epic. Um, it's great to be back home again. For those of you who remember... Uh, in 2011, I did a moving out video where I moved out of my old apartment complex and uh, moved out of my old apartment. And now I am back here again. Uh, so yeah, and, and I wish I could have done a epic move-in video. I thought about doing that, but the truth is, there was just no way because I was tired and uh, I couldn't really make time for a housewarming party that day or whatever. And that day of moving back here, I was really, really, really tired. And yeah, so at the end of the day, I just really laid down and didn't do much at all, and just chilled in my new apartment. Didn't want to do anything. It was like kind of like, it was like that last year too, when I moved to my other apartment that I just moved out of. I was supposed to have a housewarming party, and I only one person, one maybe two people showed up anyway, and I was kind of happy because I was exhausted from moving and all that stuff, and I wanted to sleep. But anyway. Yeah, for two weeks now, I've been living in this new apartment. Back to my old apartment complex where I first did videos and all that stuff. So, it's been a crazy three-year journey, to say the least. But I'm glad I'm back home. And, yeah, so, regarding my videos and stuff, uh, I don't want to give a 2014 year review yet because the year's not over. Um, but, 2014 so far, I can say it's definitely been better, well, in, in, uh, in real life than it was 2013. Um, but as far as YouTube goes, uh, I think I did more videos. I was more consistent in my videos in 2013 than it was this year. So, I mean, here on out, like, there's my uh, video consistency is going to vary. Um, I mean, I'm still doing Yoshi's Island. Hopefully it won't take three years like I did Ocarina of Time. But, I mean, from here on out, there's just no predicting my video production uh, it'll just come out whenever I have time to do it I do make a better effort in getting the SC2K videos out uh, because especially when I do commentary because you know it's all in, in SC2K videos there's always someone with me doing commentary it's never solo commentary on there so for their sake you know even though they may never watch it anyway after they re, uh, record with me um, I still want to get it done and get it up you know but my solo videos, I kind of take my sweet time because it's just me and the videos. And you know, uh, even though I really sh should speed up in Yoshi's Island, the truth is, uh, you guys know how it is life gets in the way. And if you noticed over the past few years, um, you probably wonder what happened to a few people um, like, you know, Swindoll, Venom, Angel, the Unknown, J Man, even though J Man made an appearance in Mortal Kombat 3 recently. Um, yeah, the truth is, uh, you know, they all have lives, and as fun as YouTube is, um, sometimes some people get tired of it, or they have lives that they get married, have a family, and move on. Uh, but, I mean, these past seven years, though, have been great with uh, with YouTube. I mean, I may met some great friends over the years on YouTube, such as We Guy, J-Man, Star Soldier, Gen 2, etc. And... Um, what was I going to say? Give me a second. Of course, I can edit this out, but I'm too lazy. Oh, yeah. I was going to say, uh, I don't have millions of subscribers or thousands of followers on Facebook and Twitter, but I still had a lot of fun doing this. And I know I sound like I'm about to just quit for soon. Quit, quit soon. Quit for sure. And no, I'm not. But, uh, I was just watching uh, the AVGN episode of Desert Bus, and it was his 10th year anniversary. And uh, he was jo uh, teasing about retiring, but he never did because he said, I have a purpose here. My, you know, my purpose is to make people aware of crappy games, and I must continue on. And so I feel like I kind of had a purpose too. And, and again, I'm not big and popular on YouTube, but you know, I, I, I did meet someone named Minecraft Martin not too long ago. 
that's about three years ago, so it was kind of long ago. Um, and he said that he had been watching me for years before he finally started commenting on my videos. So the thing is, for those of you who have you know, good intentions of actually reviewing games or just doing LPs just for fun and entertaining people, you know, even if you're not getting popular or having a lot of subscribers or whatever, or even have a few haters, don't stop doing what you're doing as long as you enjoy doing it. Now, honestly, I don't enjoy doing this as much as I used to, but I still like to do it. Um, and so, you know, I want to uh, encourage you to continue doing this on YouTube if you really, really want to do it. And you could be impacting somebody out there in, in, a, in some way. Or just making them aware of a, a game that's horrible. Uh, or just to entertain somebody that had a bad day. And, he, and your channel was one of the channels that they watch to escape reality and just to get away from everything. And I've always hoped that my channels have done that. Um, I do it for fun, but I would also like to do it to entertain people and help them out when they're having a bad day. And for those of you who remember, I mentioned Armate 21, and when he did videos back then, I would watch his videos a lot during the summer 2007, right before I st uh, started doing videos. And he was uh, watching his videos inspired me to start doing that. And during that time in my life, it was a rough time. You know, changes here and there. Chris Benoit killed himself and his family. I mean, that kind of got me too. And that, uh, being a wrestling fan, I mean, new jobs, school. Oh, man, it was rough. Um, and so watching his videos at the end of the day really, really entertained me during that time. and kind of helped me keep my composure. And so I'm hoping my videos are somewhat doing that, you know. Um, so I love to do this to entertain people and also really to... If someone's having a bad day, I um, would love to help someone feel better somehow through my videos. And for those of you who are wondering why um, some of my friends haven't been appearing anymore, well, uh, there's various stories to that. Uh, I mean, over the years, whether it's people I've grew up with or people that I met online on YouTube, like Swindoll, he's just, uh, he don't have as much free time anymore like he used to. I mean, he has a family now, and he has a job where he's on call 24-7. So he don't have as much free time as he did back then. So uh, he, he, he's done with commentary. He's done. I really wish he would come back even once in a while to do commentary, but there's just really no way. I mean, when, when he's done with his uh, work day, uh, he wants to relax, hang out with his family, and chill, and just just relax you know he he, he don't want to do commentary come up here and do commentary um and plus even when he's off work he's not really off he's on call so sometimes he'll get a call anytime because he's on a on the maintenance crew here where i live at the apartment complex and so he just don't have time or if he does have time he don't want to spend that free time doing commentary on videos so he's pretty much done and uh, Venom 22 just kind of got tired of it, and he just wanted to do one last review, and that was Super Mario World, a game that he loves. So he did that, and he's done. Angel got married not too long ago. The Unknown, it's unknown what he's been doing, but I haven't seen him in a while. And there's other people I met online, like, years ago, that haven't done commentary with me in a while. I'm not sure what's going on, but maybe they're just busy with life. Like Minecraft Martin, uh, RGX... Uh, and some of you know the story of what happened with me and Charlie from Strictly Sega and even though I'm still cool with some of the Strictly Sega crew uh, me and Charlie had that ridiculous falling out even though we did speak not too long ago a little bit on Facebook but uh, yeah and so over the years people have come and gone in my videos on the Ron Moore channel and S2K channels and uh, we had a lot of fun with the Skip Rogers channel I know that but Skip Rogers' channel is pretty much done too. So, uh, yeah, and you know, I just felt like talking about that, about my YouTube career, and uh, just uh, giving an update on what's going on. And so, yeah, uh, hopefully, there's some of you listening out there, even if you never posted a comment in the past seven years of my videos or whatever. Hopefully, my videos have somewhat entertained you, made you feel better at the end of the day. And yeah, I mean, I like to do this for fun, mainly, you know, do it for the purpose of just having fun in my free time. But over the past seven years, I mean, it's been fun, especially 2009, 2010. Those are the two, those are the best years of my YouTube life. I mean, that's when SC2K started and, and then 
2009-2010, me, J-Man, we guy, Bear, Gentoo. We did a lot of commentaries together. And it's been great. Uh, and so I want to continue doing that. And uh, it's been a fun experience on YouTube, and I don't really want to quit doing it. For the sake of, you know, having fun in my free time and just interacting with people, the whole experience of it has been pretty ECW. So, yeah, I just wanted to kind of ramble about that to you guys for a minute. Um, as far as more updates in my life, uh, I've just still been busy working two jobs. I mean, technically I have three. My third one is my web design business, but it hasn't picked up yet. I've only had one client since then. Um, so hopefully by next year, by January, when I'll actually have more free time, I will uh, have more time and energy to put forth my web design business print out more business cards and all that stuff so I know it's going to take a while so right now my business is going to be my side business until it becomes a full time thing my goal is for it to be full time so it's going to take a while but that's fine um, right now I've mainly been busy in my two restaurant jobs and so now I live in a cheaper place with cheaper rent and uh, roach free apartment and a much better living environment so it's great to be back here and yep so that is it i am out of here i do uh i have not forgotten about yoshi's island i have been working on part seven part seven is almost done um i do have another sd2k lp if my computer permits it uh it will be ecw um and i think i have one or two other ron mora videos coming up so yeah and that's all I have to say right now. So that's it, guys. I am out of here. Thank you very much for listening. And, yeah, if you want to, post a comment and uh, let me know what you think about my YouTube uh, career and how it may have impacted you and if it does entertain you for, or if it bores you and puts you to sleep. Just like this rambling. Okay, guys, I'm out of here. Ron Moore, God bless. Take care. <laughs>